Want to see more cool videos on our channel? We do, so press this bell and enable to send notifications. It's all fun and games until you're dragged out by a riptide, bitten by a shark, or contaminated by radioactive waste. The world's oceans, seas, rivers and lakes are begging to be explored, but some of the most spectacular are also the most deadly. Don't be fooled by pretty scenery or intriguing wildlife. Even the most inviting hot spring or serene mountain lake could be hiding a hazardous secret. Number 12. Drake Passage British Antarctic Survey, or BAS, scientists believe that approximately 30 to 50 million years ago, South America and Antarctica split apart very rapidly, owing to which the Drake Passage was formed, and this resulted in a major global cooling. The Drake Passage stretches for just under 1,000 kilometers, and as the spot where the Atlantic, Pacific and Southern Seas converge, creating a roaring current mix that has the potential to make you regret that extra serve of pasta at supper. What makes the Drake Passage so infamously rough is the fact that currents at this latitude meet no resistance from any landmass anywhere on the planet. Coupled with the area's propensity for high wind, a crossing of the Drake Passage can be quite the adventurous exploit. Water within the Drake Passage flows predominantly from west to east and forms part of the Antarctic Circumpolar Current, the most voluminous current in the world with an estimated rate of flow between 3,400 and 5,300 million cubic feet per second, which is about 600 times the flow of the Amazon River. That's pretty scary. Number 11. Lake Champlain You may recognize Lake Champlain from the 2014 movie Blood Lake Attack of the Killer Lampreys. As you may have guessed, several Lake Champlain lamprey attacks served as inspiration for the film. Lampreys are ancient blood-sucking snake-like fish that latch onto other fish with their razor-sharp teeth to feed on their blood and nutrients. Oh, and they also attack humans. Especially in British rivers and lakes, lampreys are on the rise, so always make sure that there hasn't been any recent lamprey attacks prior to taking a dip in a British body of water. Number 10. Rio Tinto Originating in the Sierra del Huelva Mountains of Andalusia in the town of Nerva, Spain's Red River runs through the southwestern region of the country. For approximately 5,000 years, copper, gold, silver and other minerals have been mined along the river. Rio Tinto is still a beautiful place to visit, but not swim though, because the river's ecosystem of bacteria that oxidizes metals found in the water causes the water to turn a poignant bright red. The high acidity keeps people away from the waters, but draws scientists in. Extremophile aerobic bacteria in the water provide conditions similar to those found in other areas in the solar system, such as Jupiter's moon Europa. Life in the Rio Tinto, bacteria feeding on iron and sulfide minerals in the river's subsurface rocks, makes the likelihood of life on Europa all the more possible. Number 9. The Dead Sea Though the Dead Sea may seem like an impossible place to drown, thanks to the buoyancy it gives swimmers in its salty waters, it was actually named the second most dangerous place to swim in Israel. You can absolutely drown in the Dead Sea, just not in the normal way. When a person's floating on their back, there's no problem. But if they turn around and start floating on their stomach, the water is so dense that it can be hard to stand up or even push the limbs down into the water to turn on their back again. If you do want to try your luck at floating along the Dead Sea, it's always safer to head to an area where there's a lifeguard on duty. Number 8. Cahill's Crossing Cahill's Crossing on the East Alligator River in the Northern Territory is notorious for its croc-infested waters and human misadventure. Each year, dozens of brazen divers attempt to make it across the submerged crossing, but instead end up being washed away into the croc-infested waters. Others risk their lives by wading in the waters and fishing. Some even bring their children. Rangers last year conducted a survey of the East Alligator River and counted 120 crocodiles in a 6-kilometer stretch south of Cahill's Crossing. The crossing is popular with tourists and fishermen, despite warning signs that point out an extreme risk of saltwater crocodile attacks. Yet some people continue to risk and sometimes lose their lives. Number 7. Potomac River Just outside Washington, D.C., the Potomac River Gorge is a 14-mile stretch that extends from the Key Bridge in the District of Columbia North to the Great Falls of the Potomac. The gorge is a popular site for outdoor activities like kayaking, boating, fishing and hiking enthusiasts, but there's no doubt that this river is deadly. The water rushing through the Potomac River creates roiling underwater currents in even the calmest looking places, 
The river's currents can quickly capture swimmers, waders and people who slip and fall into the water, so never ever get fooled by its placid look. Number 6. The Boiling River Deep in the Amazon lies a river four miles long and unlike any other on Earth. The Shanay Timpishka is so hot that any animal that steps into it gets boiled alive. When a hapless creature wanders in, the eyes cook first, melting in its skull. Soon the animal is in too much pain to keep swimming to safety. Water fills its mouth and lungs and it's cooked from the inside out. The river gets as hot as 91 degrees Celsius or 196 degrees Fahrenheit, and scientists aren't completely sure why. Normally, water that gets this hot is fed by a volcano, but this one is 700 kilometers removed from the nearest one. There is a theory, though. Scientists believe that boiling hot water from under the earth cracks through fault lines and heats up the river, making the water a geothermal system unlike any other on the earth. Number 5. Jacob's Well If you're looking for relief from the stifling Texas heat, you'll likely be drawn to the near-constant 68 degree Fahrenheit crystal clear water of Jacob's Well. Jacob's Well is home to some of the most dangerous diving caves in the world. It also happens to be the entrance of Texas's second longest fully submerged cave, with plunging depths of 100 feet or more. The mouth is a 30-foot deep natural well that opens up at the bottom to a broad network of caves that have many inexperienced divers never leave. For those of you who want to just relax and enjoy this natural wonder, feel free to safely dip your toes around the well's entrance. But if you're a daredevil, you know who you are you may want to look somewhere else. There have been eight diving fatalities between the years of 1964 and 1984, and therefore only researchers with special permits are allowed to explore the unforgiving depths of Jacob's Well today. There are various signs posted around the well reading, Stop! Prevent your death! Go no farther! Along with facts concerning the frequent cave deaths. Number 4. Lake Natron If a body of water is unfit for life, it's a good bet that it's unfit for swimming. Lake Natron, located in northern Tanzania, reaches temperatures of 120 degrees Fahrenheit. It's covered in a red salt crust and has a pH level as high as 10.5, making it pretty unsuitable for living creatures. According to local legend, the lake turns anything that touches it into stone, and that's the reason the lake is also known as Medusa Lake. Geologists are intrigued by the lake's strange chameleon waters and the legend of living things turning into stone. In fact, it can burn the skin and eyes of animals that aren't adapted to the lake's specific makeup. Because the lake's crusted salt has a red tint to it, it's a popular spot for flamingos, and it can be a cool place to visit. Just don't take a dip while you're at it. Number 3. Lake Karache Lake Karache has been called the most polluted place on Earth. During the 1950s, the lake was used as a dumping site for radioactive materials from a nearby nuclear waste storage and reprocessing facility. A string of accidents and disasters contaminated the surrounding area even further, causing 65% of the local residents to fall ill with radiation sickness. Some parts of the lake are so dangerous that they could deliver a lethal dose of radiation in an hour. Lake Karache is slowly being filled with concrete and soil in an effort to seal the radiation, but it's not a holiday destination we're eager to visit. Number 2. Amazon Basin, South America the Amazon Basin stretches across South America, covering nearly 40% of the continent in the countries of Bolivia, Brazil, Colombia, Ecuador, Guyana, Peru, Suriname and Venezuela. A mind-boggling array of flora and fauna call the basin and the Amazon rainforest home. A mind-boggling number of them also want to kill you. Dare to dive in the water here and you could meet your end courtesy of eels, piranhas, alligators, anacondas or the kandiru a parasitic freshwater catfish that reportedly has a nasty habit of invading openings in the human body. Number 1. Sitarum River, Indonesia Unfortunately, the reason why Sitarum River is deadly is because of something man-made. Garbage. The place is so filled with non-biodegradable waste and harmful chemicals that it's known to be the world's most polluted river. There are over 200 textile factories lying in the riverbanks and the dyes and chemicals like arsenic and mercury are all dumped in the river. Combine this with the millions of residents who treat the river as a huge trash bin and for sure no one's crazy enough to drink the water from this dump site. Thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed the video please let me know by clicking the like button, do share, write a comment and don't forget to subscribe so you can catch up my next video.